Welcome to the Suerte del Molino Farm, Andalusia and Spain. Here we have transplanted Paulovnias in the middle of summer. And the verdict is they are all doing well, except I've managed to kill one of them. And it didn't matter whether I cut the leaves or left the leaves. Um, they recovered. So um, even the ones I pollarded is doing fine. But also I have learned that plants can actually dig into the reserves of the stem and then soon as that is exhausted then it just dies. Um, I have transplanted quite a few of the mulberries but most of them didn't make it because they have still have tiny root system they need much more time and um, this is the sweet cucumber it worked somehow the mulberry didn't that one took This one didn't, this one did. So, overall a success. I am happy. Now, what is happening in the sandbox? The reason why I took the Bolovnias out is because they actually took all the sun from the other plants. Again, quite a few of these mulberries didn't make it. A lack of light initially, and then perhaps uh, too much light after I removed the Bolovnias. Now the question was will the roots of the polofnias that are left here germinate now that's already one here whether that was a plant that i missed which i doubt i think it just came up but it's the only one so one swallow doesn't make a summer. I will have to see what else. In the other non polofnia sandbox, these are Cape gooseberries. And these are uh, asparagus planted from seed. And it's just cute when uh, we planted the seed, it grew, and now it's making seed. So it's time to move on. Decorative peach and okra. I planted uh, many other seeds here that didn't take. So, overall, a success so far. Today, 109, perhaps more, uh, Fahrenheit, degrees Fahrenheit, 43, tomorrow as well, and then we might get a break. The fire we had was started by what is called dry thunder, dry thunderstorms, lightning. But it's all gone now. I'm happy about that. Till next time. Goodbye.